Welcome back everyone and I'm here again with Jeff Grant, SBR contributor, and today we're going to be looking at that Cincinnati Reds against the St. Louis Cardinals game. But first off, how are you doing today, Jeff? Doing great, Dax. This is a very important game in shaping who's going to win the National League Central Division, so I'm glad to talk to you about it. Awesome, awesome, my man. All right, um, Jeff, pretty much we all know how, how the Reds have been struggling since the All-Star break, but do you think that they can turn things around and make a run for one of the two spots in the NL wildcard? I think they have a chance of, of winning one of those two spots because nobody's really running away uh, with that uh, fact of trying to land one of those two National League wildcard spots, they're not going to catch uh, the division leader likely because they just fell two games under 500 after getting swept in a series against the Colorado Rockies, leading both of those games in the Mile High City, but the bullpen giving away uh, both ball games. And with the bullpen having an over six ERA over the last uh, two weeks, it's not looking good for the Reds in terms of the division, but they do still have an outside chance of landing one of those wild card spots. All right, now I know it's not much considering it's the Padres, but they have been doing well though. But the Cards just earned a series victory against them at Bush Stadium. Now, do you expect this team to carry that momentum over into tonight's game? Yeah, the Padres aren't the Padres of April and May. They're actually playing some of the best baseball. So you definitely have to consider that the Cardinals did just beat a quality opponent. And the key thing in this matchup is the Cardinals have absolutely owned the Reds when playing at home uh, over the last five or six years. So definite edge with the Redbirds over the Reds in this one. All right, man. And some sources say that the Cards manager, Mike Matney, um, actually liked what he saw from starting pitcher Justin Masterson. Now, that was his third start. But do you think that the matches, how is he going to match up against the Reds lineup? Yeah, Matheny was very happy. He saw some live sinker ball action with Masterson last time out. This will be his fourth start with the Cardinals. And really, St. Louis got him because he does have experience against the Reds in his career, uh, mainly in interleague play. Master, Masterson has won his last three starts against Cincinnati, so expect another uh, quality effort from the right-hander. All right, so considering all that, what's your lean going to be on for this game? I'm going to back the Cardinals to win the series opener. Uh, the Reds, like I said, dropped a couple uh, games that they should have won, and when a team drops under that 500 mark this late in the season and really is looking up at the division, the clubhouse really has low morale, but more importantly, I'm going to look to back the Cardinals in the first five innings because I don't trust their bullpen either. So I'm going to go St. Louis first five innings against Cincinnati. Good stuff, my man. Thank you very much, Jeff. Uh, valuable insights again, and can't wait to talk to you again tomorrow, my man. Appreciate it. Thank you. For SportsbookReview.com, this is Dax Floyd.